Oh, Melty Blood. Nice. Melty Blood. That, that's, that's a rare one, but that's good. All right, we got some Lay Fate. Mr. Mr. Wu-Tang Clan. That's what I like to call him, Mr. Wu-Tang, because he's a Shaolin. Let's go. So we got UYG Crimson versus Evil Kevin. We got Jackie on the right here. Let's go. Okay, so right now, they're just killing each other out. Getting in there. Ooh, nice. Nice stuff by Leifei going in. Nice. He's setting up the, the, the 2P setups. Going into the car. Ooh, nice flash kick. He's got the guile in them. Oh, oh man. UIG Crimson is really going in right now. He really understands how Leifei's attacks work. Good follow up. Alright, let's go for round two. Let's see if Evil Ken can. Evil Kevin, sorry, not Evil Ken. Evil can come back. Oh, 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 man, the juggle. Oh, no. Okay, UIG Crimson knows the game. He knows this game well. He's going in with the follow up. Okay, let's see. Let's see if Evil Kevin can come back here. The blocks. Oh, got him on the wall. Once you're against the wall, guys, you gotta really try and get yourself out of that position because this stage, especially the octagon, is very small, and so there's very little space for you to, to move, for you to move. So you really have to utilize your movements in this uh, in this particular stage. You gotta really do a lot of evading in this in this stage. Good stuff. All right, evil evil Kevin's trying to pick up the evades here. Okay, so he's, he's on disadvantage there, so that was kind of a bad way to... <laughs> he's trolling him out. What's going on? Wow, is this a rage quit? Or is that just a disconnect? Is that a rage quit? Evil Kevin can't take the, uh, the Shaolin? The Shaolin got to him. <laughs> Shaolin, the Shaolin Temple got to him. He got Bob. Okay, okay, just, just, just disconnect? Alright, okay. Alright, alright. <laughs> I thought it was a rage quit. Alright, so let's get back into this again. <laughs> I thought the Shaolin Temple got the Jackie's head. Alright, so that's one nothing for Crims. Crimson is really going in. He really understands late phase potential. Um, playing this game since VF2, uh, I understand that late it was always a character that a lot of people seem to avoid because he was very difficult, especially with a lot of his uh, different stances. Um, but I noticed in, in, um, in VF5, it's kind of improved a bit. He's still a bit difficult to use, but he's definitely a lot easier uh, from his past iteration, so it's good. So things are still going in. Oh, nice. Good stuff. I'm going to try and stay away from all the technical jargon because uh, I'm not too sure if a lot of you guys are familiar with it. I'll just keep things very basic for now, but if you guys have questions about it, feel free to let me know. Alright, so Kevin took that around there with a good flash kick. He got some guile action going in there. Alright, good stuff. Good follow up there. Mmm. Ooh, very nice. Feel like he's Crimson is taking advantage. Oh, good flash kick. Oh, he should have followed up with a ground, a ground attack. Oh, didn't finish it off there. Oh, a lot of, a lot of abode going on. Oh, very nice, very nice. That was pretty safe. That was pretty safe for Kevin. Uh, that kind of, that gave that attack gave him some advantage. Took advantage of uh, late phase mid front there. Oh, very nice combo to the wall. That was excellent. Block, 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 kick, kick, kick. You gotta punish that. Nice, good finish there by, by Crimson. 
Maybe it's BF3, if I'm not mistaken, so if it's BF3. I know for sure he's in BF3. BF2 maybe I'm not mistaken, but BF3 for sure I know he was in there. Ooh. Alright, so right now, Crimson, is, like, he's still taking advantage. He's really going in right now. He definitely understands his matchup, and it's 2-0. It is 2-0 right now. UIG Crimson takes that with Style and Finesse with Lay Fade.